Let's talk plastic pollution. No, not that stuff. This little guy, it's a nurdle. A what? So a nurdle is a small plastic pellet that has never been made into a product. There's oceans full of plastic that humans have thrown away. That's post-consumer pollution. A nurdle is pre-consumer. So these pellets are made and then shipped all over the world to factories that then melt them down to make them into water bottles, sunglasses, you know, all the different products that we use on a daily basis. If nurdles are a raw material that hasn't been made into anything, how is it winding up in our oceans and beaches? Whenever they're being onloaded or offloaded from the factory, the little bit spills on the ground. They put them onto rail cars or trucks or putting them onto ships. They fall out on the ground. Even during transportation, they can fly out. And just thousands and thousands of nurdles. It's just a tiny plastic pellet, so what harm could it really do? The problem is they look like uh, fish eggs, they look like sargasm bulbs, um, they look like seeds. And so uh, the, the animal doesn't know the difference. They end up consuming it. Uh, it uh, many times passes through their system, but if they eat enough of them, it could clog their digestive system, so they end up starving to death. So here's the good news. We can stop nurdle pollution. Nurdles is 100% preventable from getting into the environment. Here's where we need your help. So this project would not be possible without citizen scientists. Woo! Join the Nurdle Patrol and help us build an interactive map of where nurdles are found across the United States. The great thing about this uh, program is that it's simple. And so we ask people that are going to the beach already is just spend 10 minutes of your time looking for nurdles. And so once you find your first nurdle, start the clock uh, for 10 minutes. And then whenever you get how many you found within that 10 minute period, go on to nurdlepatrol.org and enter your data in there and it'll automatically show up on a map. Your data combined with thousands of other nurdle patrollers will help scientists in their research. So one of the solutions is for regulatory agencies um, to look at their stormwater permitting and make it mandatory that there's a zero pellet loss in their stormwater permitting process. And that would significantly reduce the amount of pellets getting into the environment. Plastic pollution can seem like an overwhelming problem, but if you, me, and others join the Nurdle Patrol, we can make a difference and stop Nurdle pollution. So it doesn't matter what your background is, if you like to go to the beach and you're concerned about plastic on our beaches, anybody can do this project. Please join us. Join the Nurdle Patrol right now. You are now deputized as a Nurdle Patroller. Join the Nurdle Patrol.